because it's superior. So I read the head, it's bound. So that will be superior. Ang konda is inferior. Ano? Superior, inferior. Uh, medial lateral, so wherever is the red, uh, red head, it's uh, being pointed to, that would be the medial side. Pusin uh, nyo lang, or the, the trunk anterior mo na lateral. Okay. Uh, anterior and posterior, so if ever a shaft there is smooth, siya, rounded, so it's anterior, posterior, dash a line there, present. Right now? Okay, so parts. First, you have your femoral head, the head of the femur. And then, within the head of the femur, you have a depression, and we call that depression na your phobia capitis. Ka. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Lateral to the head, this one, you now have that. Okay. Further lateral to the neck, you now have the presence of the two trunk halters. Ka. Okay. One that is more. Located. So you now have that greater trunk and third. Okay. And the other one is more smaller in size. In figure sha it's more medial. So you have your lesser trunk and third. Okay. okay. And with uh, between the two trunk and you have this structure. We call this your intertrunk and something. So anteriorly, you have this one. So it calls your intertrunk and line. Line na ang anterior. Posteriorly, you have your intertrochanteric crest. Uh, intertrochanteric crest. Uh, and within your intertrochanteric crest, na mo protrude there yung bony part, and that would now be your quadrate tubercle. Your quadrate tubercle. Ano? In a clear? Any questions so far? Then, slightly below your greater trochanter and lateral to your your trunk and there you have a protrusion there we call it your gluteal tuberosity. Ika siya magtaro but sa kanyang mga models like this one, taro ni siya ni protruding ang kamay. So that would now be your gluteal tuberosity. Okay, then you now have the shaft. Okay, anterior, anterior part, my, my bony part. Ang posterior, yun na have your linea aspera. So linea aspera ni siya. Okay. So here you have this uh, medial lip or the medial linea aspera, then lateral you have the lateral lip or lateral linea aspera. Shaft. Here. Okay, then this tell to your shaft at this level here you now have the supracondylar So this area here, medial manisha, so medial supracondylar ridge. This one lateral manisha, so lateral supracondylar ridge. Ha. Okay, within your medial supracondylar ridge, na mo protrude there, okay. we call that bony part now as the adductor tubercle. Adductor tubercle. Ha. Okay. Then also within the distal part of the shaft, you have these two surfaces. Anteriorly, you have the patellar surface. Posteriorly, you have the popliteal surface. So, patellar surface. Face, popliteal surface here. And then further below, you now have this condyles. You have the femoral condyles. So medially, you have the medial femoral condyle. Lastly, you have the lateral femoral condyle. Okay, the most extreme side here, I've expected here too. Nagupa lang on the medial side. This one, when you protrude, you now have the epicondyles. So lateral manisha, so lateral epicondyle. Then this one would be the medial femoral epicondyle. Ha. The medial. Okay. Within the two condyles, the presence of a notch, we call that notch your inter inter intercondylar notch. The intercondylar notch. Okay. Here, here, yes. here with the framework.